Yo, what's up everybody? How is it going? Today we're playing Dota. Wait, actually we're playing Legends of Dota. Damn man, I get this wrong every time. No, we're playing low budget heroes. That's what we're doing. I got a low budget Templar Assassin. So, uh, to give a brief explanation of low budget heroes, low budget heroes means you have to take a hero uh, and then replace all of the abilities with other abilities. But try to be as close to the original hero as possible. So what do we have? Well, we have... Uh, drunken Brawler instead of Refraction. But that actually kind of made sense to me, right? Like, it's it's kind of limited in time, uh, and it gives you both defensive and offensive power. And, you know, you activate it when you're trying to, like, kill somebody, or you activate it when you're trying to get out of a situation. I feel like in its use, the abilities are quite similar, even though the effect is a bit different, but that's all right. Then um, we've got uh, Take Aim instead of Side Blades. I think that's just kind of obvious. You know, that one is kind of boring, I guess, but hey, it works. I mean, we could have tried to take some sort of cleave, but I felt like it's more important that we have range as TA, right? Like, that to me felt like what really, really mattered in the end. Then we have Ginata. Now, that one may look a little weird. <laughs> so, why Ginata? Well, the thinking there was that with TA, you kind of want to use refraction with meld to do, like, a really like big combo attack right and then you also want to use you also want to want to kind of like use meld as like a big burst of damage so in that way i felt like janata could serve both those purposes a it can serve as a big burst of damage and b it works well with our chosen replacement for refraction and then finally it kind of functions on a similar timer, where if you're a TA in a fight, you know, you kind of want to just get as many attacks of... You want to get as many attacks of... Um, what's it called? Of um, meld on people as possible. So you just, like, kind of use it whenever you can, right? You just kind of spam it as much as possible. And in that way... Uh, Ginata kind of has a similar cooldown and will have kind of a sort of similar rhythm to it. That's the thinking, at least. Right, and then finally, we have Remote Mines. Remote Mines, of course, functions uh, very similar to, to Psionic Trap, with the main difference being that um, it doesn't slow instead of, you know, just kind of like only does damage, but that seemed like, you know, uh, close enough. <laughs> Like, that was really the thing. It's just like, you know, it's close enough. Anyway. So, yeah. Hello. We're going to just go ahead and get that hit in. Because why not? We can. All right, like that. That seems fine. And, uh... It's kind of rude, but we're okay with that. All right? Like, I don't really mind being rude to this boy. Alright, we got ourselves remote mines now. Activating them is going to be a little tricky. Because <laughs> we do not have the the um, activation ability. And there's really no way for us to get it. So, we're just not going to have it. And that's just, gonna, that's just it. There's just no way for us to have it. So, um, activating the remote mines will have to be like kind of a manual task. But that's all right. We can do that. Anyway, for now, I'm just kind of being a wiener with these mines. <laughs> Got him. Hey, look at that. Nice. Chased him down really quick. All right, that felt good. That felt good. How would you make a low budget techies? Well, I think that's something we'll have to figure out in the future. Honestly, right now, I have no idea. Alright, grab also some face boots. I like face boots on TA more than than treads. And uh, yeah, just kind of yeah, I like them. Also, hey, nice dragon form. <laughs> yeah, I mean like uh, Yeah, I see it. Oh, I missed that. Bit annoying, but that's okay. We're gonna just go ahead and grab ourselves. Uh, this bounty rune. Start, you know, just start healing a little bit. So sadly, we don't quite get the same value out of... Um, 
what's it out of a desolator as a TA normally does. But we do still get a bit of value out of it. Like, I mean, quite a bit, I would say. So there's a good chance we'll just go for it anyway. Also, this is really nice. <laughs> I imagine this must be one of the worst things to go up against. All right, just kind of throw down this. No, I don't really want to fight you. Ow. That shouldn't kill, though. We gotta be a bit careful with this um, Dragon Knight. Alright, give me that. <laughs> okay. Not a good miss. Got him. Got him, got him, got him. Yeah, that was an unfortunate miss, but not too big of a deal. <laughs> and nice <laughs> alright we managed to turn that around pretty quickly alright let's get out of here yeah, we want to we wanna be careful we don't want to get caught out by something like we just just caught those people Alright, start healing, and there's our Desolator. There's our Desolator. Okay. Grab ourselves this bound here. Oh! That's the sentries coming on? Yeah, 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 yeah. I get it, I get it. Very sensible, I think. A little annoying for me, of course, but, but very sensible. Nice stun. It's not enough, no. Got pretty close. Alright. I think if we, uh, you know, if we try that again, we might get him next time. Our damage output is, is really, really high. You can actually see, you know, like the Jinada really helping out. Those big swings. Right here, look at that tower. <laughs> okay. Nice. It does kind of feel like TA. It really does. Like, just the ability to have this, um, you know, like, huge burst of damage, but very, very limited in the time frame. Like, it's definitely pretty similar. So that's kind of neat. I guess we uh, managed to, you know, like, make sure it kind of feels close. And, uh, although we don't quite have the farming potential, yeah. Uh, yeah, again, I wasn't sure which one is more important with the, uh, you know, like, is it, is Cyblades more about farming and kind of like AoE attacking or is Cyblades more about having attack range, right? Like, which one is it? I don't really know. I'm not sure which one is the right answer to that. But, yeah, I just went with something, you know. All right, there's the stun. Good. Oh, we're not getting that. Okay. Well, I was kind of hoping to be able to snatch that up, but with the flying movement, it's a hard one. Oh, wouldn't you want to get that bottle first? All right. <laughs> the burst damage is there for sure. I mean, that's one of the big things I feel like we got a nail, you know? The very kind of like typical TA burst damage. If we get that, I think we did our job, right? What do you buy next? Probably BKB usually, but I don't really want to go for a BKB here. <laughs> Oh, man. Did we get him? Nope. But I can come in. <gasps> Reaper Scythe? What? 
What does this axe have? Dual and Reaper Scythe. Both. God damn, man. That's crazy, dude. That's crazy. Hex or Bloodborne. Is that what you usually go for in TA? Hex? That doesn't sound right. Yeah. Sadly, we don't have level 20 and level 25 talent. Would be nice to have something at least, but we don't. Making life a tad bit more difficult. Oh, well, why don't we just go for notify? Oh, that sounds like a really nice item here, actually. I like it. They do spend a lot of time running away from me. Maybe we can do something about that. <laughs> that doesn't seem like a bad idea at all. All right. Oh no. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> All right, well, we just annihilated that poor, poor dazzle. With the big, big crit. The enemy's bottom tower has fallen. Yeah, no, we gotta be careful here. Oh, battle hunger. Okay, that's a, that's an interesting battle hunger. I don't think we have anything there. Yeah, we gotta somehow catch him with a net. Or something of the sort. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Thanks for that dual damage, I appreciate it. Actually comes in quite handy. Alright, this guy is definitely dead. Let's see if we can do something about this dazzle. Got him. Got him. Look at this TA going nuts, man. That's what we like to see. Alright. Here is my nullifier, which I think the nullifier, uh, you know, it's just just kind of something to stop them from running away. And stop them from blade mailing. Oh, wind run. Oh, as Omni Slash. I dig it. All right, I'm dead. <laughs> Windrun as Omni Slash. That's actually kind of neat. Because like a melee melee range win oh, not Windrun, sorry, um focus fire. Right? Like but like a melee range focus fire is actually pretty omni slashy, if you be to ask me. That seems pretty pretty good. I like it. Alright. Oh nice. This, by the way, I think is a neat combination. The Glimpse and Split Earth. That feels a lot like Kunkka. That's for sure. I'll probably get a BKB. You know, a little bit more damage, but mostly... Uh, quite a bit of protection. I mean, you're dead. I mean, good luck with that. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, you guys wanna do some damage? I need some attack speed. I attack pretty slowly, so I can't really get these incredibly um you know valuable drunken brawler hits in that quickly. Would be good. Yeah, we'll just take it. You know, we'll take a bit of blade mail damage, but that's okay. We can take it. Alright, let's maybe uh, see if we can get a push down on their base. 
Kind of, uh... Oh! That is clear. That's kind of a shame, man. I don't think it's enough. I honestly don't think it gets all that close. So anyway, something we haven't really done yet is look at all of the other heroes. Let's look at the enemies while we can. So we've got Split Earth, Great Cleave, Glimpse, and Earth Splitter. Earth Splitter is kind of interesting. Dragon Eye, Dragon Slave, Ray Fire Blast, Reactive Armor, Arctic Burn. Axe got Dual, Spirit Scythe, Moment of Courage, and Reaper Scythe. This is not enough. Okay. We've got our uh, Naga here. Counter Helix, Earthbind, Conjure Image, and Guardian Angel. Monkey King with Chaos Strike, Blink, Searing Arrows, and Juxtapose. Which this is a stretch, but sure. Sniper with Sticky Napalm, Overload, Psy Blades, and Mystic Flare. Wait, you've got Sticky Napalm and Mystic Flare. Holy damn. Also, I don't really see it, but sure. I don't really see that that much there. But now we've got Flame God, Magic Missile, Split Shot, and Sunstrike. Mystic Flare and Sticky Napalm sounds kind of nasty, if you ask me. Alright, well, we got some damage in. I mean, yeah. You're dead. You are quite dead. Peter Dagger is a better representation of his assassinate. Or like Enchant Totem. <laughs> or just Laguna Blade or something, you know? Don't you think Laguna Blade or, or Thing of Death might be good? Got him. This is TA. I like it. That's all this is, dude. This is just TA. I'll take these guys. And then... Hmm. We gotta build something else here. I'm not really sure what that's gonna be. Probably like a Hurricane Pike. Having some extra mobility is always nice. Some extra attack range is always nice too. Yeah. So we can like snipe some of these kills from a bit further away. Or well, we could get like an assault cross. Alright, hello dude. Uh poo. Alright, nice try, dude. Anybody here? No? I still have edges. I kind of want to get an opportunity to use it, but we don't want to dive too deep. There we go. Luckily, the edges didn't bug out. And uh, I think that's probably going to be it. So, a pretty short game here. But I think all around still fun. Right. The enemy's down. All around still pretty fun. Did I get the axe? No. Fountain heals too much. Fountain heals far too much. I also, honestly, the 
um, the the uh, brewmaster drunken brawler. That ability is insane. God, that thing goes mega nuts. All right, boom. <laughs> yeah, you know they're okay. <laughs> The mines are okay, they're, they're trying. Alright. Axe chasing on a gyro. You know, the axe is pretty powerful. There's even a duel. Oh, nice! Dazzle with the save. This Dazzle is nasty, by the way. It's real. Um, I mean, it's not over yet. Riam Dazzle is still happening. No, you're dead. Unless there's an hour of rearm here. Nope. Why a deny? Use your mines? Nah. Nah. I'm not using the mines. Don't be silly. I think we'll get a butterfly. Don't be silly, people. Oh, God. <laughs> I mean, we got him. We got him. Pick up that, thank you very much. Oh wait, somebody already used the moon shot on me. Hey, well, I guess. I'm gonna use it on somebody else now. Yeah, no. No, my good sir, you don't stand a chance there. Good. Hey, uh, Tiberius, thank you very much, dude. And there we go. All right. All right. Oh, thank you very much, everybody. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I hope to see you guys tomorrow. Goodbye.